So guys, first we have one cup of all-purpose flour. Then you put uh, 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 all of it on a sieve. Powdered sugar, uh, powdered sugar on the refined flour. Two tablespoons of chocolate powder. One teaspoon baking powder. Four uh, teaspoon baking soda. Keep them thoroughly. Make sure to mix all the uh, dry ingredients properly. Now get another bowl to mix all the wet ingredients. First, three tablespoons of thick thickened curd. In that, mix one fourth cup of oil. We are using olive oil. Add two pinches of salt. A half cup of warm milk and mix them well. Put about one teaspoon of vanilla essence. But you can also add chocolate essence. Now mix the wet ingredients with the dry ingredients. With the help of a spoon or a spatula, mix the dry and wet ingredients well. You can also use the cut and fold method. By with this, you uh, cut through the half with your uh, 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 spoon or uh, spatula, uh, and then mix it like normal, and keep on doing this. Half tablespoon of vinegar, any closed container, and uh, put some salt on it, uh, and uh, mount. Uh, and then preheat for 10 minutes. Mount and then preheat for 10 minutes and on me medium flame. Put oil and grease your pan thoroughly. Then grease uh, uh, the paper. Because butter paper. Grease the sides while uh, the, uh, the mixture is made. See how. Uh, uh, Smooth and silky it is. It should come down like ribbons. Put the mixture in the pan. It's looking very nice. Now, now it's staying back. Once the entire mixture is transferred into the pan, then uh, uh, then give it uh, uh, a soft tap. Keep the pan in the preheated container. It should sit like this and then cover the lid. Keep the flame medium for about 40 minutes. Finally my cake is ready. This is the uh, uh, result. It's, see how soft it is. It's soft and moist.